Hi, this is Dorothy from TaiChiBozeman.com slash raw food club and from FaveDiets.com. We made raw sugar cookies today. They came out so good that I'm so happy to make another batch for me. And uh, here's how you do it. You put just six, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven ingredients in the food processor. And it was a cup of almond and oats, which you just put in there and grind up a little bit. And then one and a half tablespoon coconut oil, and a half a cup of coconut crystals or raw sugar or raw, you know, turbinado sugar or date sugar, and a tablespoon of um, psyllium seed. Now this takes the place of the egg, and it makes it so thick. It's really a secret ingredient that everybody's got to glom onto because it makes dough like this. And then because these are pretty dry, you'll need a little fourth cup of coconut milk or almond milk or just water. And a teaspoon of cinnamon and a little pinch of salt. But I did it for you today because I want to show you the hard part. I mean, what appears to be hard, but it isn't. So you take out all the dough and see how thick, nice and thick it is? I really believe that's due to the um, psyllium seed. And spread it out on a piece of parchment covered <coughs> dehydrator sheet. And by the way, coconut oil, don't be afraid to use that. A lot of people think their recipe is not healthy anymore, but it's not true. Coconut oil, extra virgin coconut oil, cold pressed, um, it has amazing benefits for you. And they're due mainly to the lauric acid. Also has capric acid and caprylic acid, but it's an antimicrobial, antioxidant, antifungal, antibacterial. It soothes your hair, your skin, um, helps you lose weight, and it's non-hydrogenated. It helps your digestion. It uh, helps diabetes, heart problems, blood pressure. So use this through the holidays and. My husband just reminded me that uh, raw foodists might be the only ones that actually lose weight during the holidays. It's actually hard to keep weight on if you're on a raw food diet. So you got to get some oil in your diet every day. So that's your skin and hair. Everything will be healthy. So anyway, you just mix that up for about 30 seconds. Put it on here. Now the secret here is to take a piece of plastic wrap and set it over your dough. And then take your rolling pin, and if you don't have a rolling pin, use a wine bottle or an apple cider bottle, that's what my mom taught me. And make it as thick or as thin as you want. I happen to like thicker cookies, thick and chewy. Um, so I'm going to leave it about a fourth of an inch here. But isn't that nice? And it's just so not sticky and it's so smooth. And then take your your um, cookie cutter or your, do you want to get closer here the camera, or your wine glass. Press it into the dough or your wine glass to make circles and then scoop these onto the onto the separate part of the paper and you can just you could even cut your own with knives or whatever. And then sprinkle a little bit of coconut crystals or raw sugar on top. And you'll want to cook these in the dehydrator at 105 degrees for 12 to 24 hours, depending on how crispy you want them. And then turn them over. In fact, see, this is about 12 hours. And the backs are still chewy. So if you want the whole thing crispy, leave them in about 24 hours. And then have them with your favorite cup of tea or um, with some almond eggnog that I made on my last video. Enjoy from Dorothy at TaiChiBozeman.com slash raw food blog and from FaveDiets.com.